Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Muhammad Awaludin My registration number is L1M2 Oke, okay. on this occasion I will present my material about Tabu word and Opumism So, Tabu word is a part of social linguistic related to language and public Tabu word is tabu word is a word that is not considered con, that's not considered good by society society or is better avoided because they mention facts that are considered rude and impolite. Tabu describe uh, something that is prohibited, danger, dangerous or prohibited because it is not appropriate with religion and customs in society. Tabu words are forbidden to pronounce because they are untrue uh, um, and are seen as bad and harsh language. There are six tabu words and I will explicit one by one. Okay, first, tabu words relate to sex. The term sex is a translation from Latin. The use of taboo words related to sex depends on the factors that influence it, the occurrence of mention of these words, namely uh, the situation, the level of familiarity of the speaker, and so on. These taboo words are divided into two categories based on the place. That activities uh, first activities in the room or bedroom activities. Tabu words uh, that fall into the category of activities in the room. For example, uh, sorry, like a uh, fuck. Uh, second, uh, activities in the bedroom or bedroom activities. The tabu word that is included in the category of activities in the bathroom is one card. Okay, next in part two, tabu words are relating to the natural functions of the human body and human body parts. The mention of tabu words below relates to something that comes naturally from humans or a special part or a human person for example like a spat uh, third tabu words relate to animals the use of the word tabu at this level will get public criticism because equating the position of humans with animals Example like uh, dogs. Fourth, words relate to deed. Everything that gives rise to dreadful fear is included in taboo category of this type. This word is a taboo word because it is considered a word that can have a frightening effect on, on those who listen. For example, like uh, did. For example, like did. Fifth, taboo words relate to excretion. The expression which means dirt is something that is taboo because it is impolite when spoken to other person. The mention of this word is considered rude, obscene, and can violate the room of politeness. For example, like shit. I'm sorry, for example, like a shit. And the last is 
tabu wars relate to religion or religion in British society. There are certain words that religion people should not say. Oh, for example, like, oh my god. Okay, let's continue to to present to present about uh, what is uh, euphemism. Uh, euphemism are most refined or polite expressions in place of words that are considered harsh or impolite. In other words. Uh, optimism emphasizes words that have positive connotation rather than negative connotation. So, in other words, uh, optimism emphasizes words that have positive connotations rather than negative connotation. The form of uh, optimism sometimes takes the form of idiomatic expression. Idiomatic expressions. Here are some examples of the use of euphemism in English. I I will give a uh, five example. The first example is he pays away. This uh this uh, if we say he pays away, this is uh, like have meaning positive connotation, but this is to describe what connotative negation yeah. the, the negative connotation is D The second example is I shall have to spend a penny And the connotation the, the negative connotation is uh, urinate But to uh, to to describe what the positive connotation we uh we we, we say with uh, I shall have to spend a penny like that uh the third is I don't like adult magazine adult magazine uh the the quantitative negation is pornographic. So, uh, the positive connotation, I don't like adult magazine. The, uh, the fourth example is, I'm um, financially embraced at the moment. This is a uh, have negative connotation if we say, I don't have money. Like that. And the last example is, he is between jobs. Have a negative connotation is unemployed, unemployed. From the examples, it can be seen that uh, euphemism are sometimes in the form of idiomatic expression. In the form of idiomatic expressions. Expression as in pass away, spend a penny, and between jobs. However, uh, there are those who only use more polite equivalent. Such as a pornographic being replaced with adult. Okay, I think uh, enough for me, and I hope uh, you can get my point. And I say I close uh, by say wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.